Hello, it's Johnny. Uh, we're going to do some tests. I added the Killer Instant in 1 and 2. And this is the virtual image. Virtual man image on uh, 512 gigabyte. The one I just uh, up, I just uh, modified. And I'm using uh, May 2003 for both of them. And it sounds pretty good. And it played pretty well. So... I'll let you listen to the, I guess, the entry. This is the RK uh, May 2003 version. It's pretty good. I think the entry wasn't as the sound in the beginning wasn't that great, but the game overall play was good. So, all right. So let's get out this game and then try the. Let's try the two. I'm also using May two thousand three on this one as well.
This one, the sound is not as good as the first one, but the gameplay is, is alright. There's no slowdown in gameplay. So those are Killer Instinct, I just want to demo that, uh, I did overclock it and I'll put the overclock information at the bottom and I'm also using a little bit better than the, than the regular sand disc, well it's a, still a sand disc but the speed is a little bit different and I'll put that in the description as well and thank you for watching and I just went and moved the file over since I have you know plenty of space so and I went in uh, connected to the network and plug in my keyboard so got that working all right hello it's Johnny uh, we're gonna do some tests I added the killer instant in one and two and this is a virtual image virtual man image on uh, 512 gigabyte the one I just uh, up, I just uh, modified, and I'm using uh, May 2003 for both of them, and it sounds pretty good and it played pretty well. So I'll let you listen to the, I guess the entry. This is the RK uh, May 2003 version. It's pretty good. I think the entry wasn't as the sound in the beginning wasn't that great, but the game overall play was good. So, all right, so let's get out of this game. 
And then try the, let's try the two. I'm also using May 2003 on this one as well. This one, the sound is not as good as the first one, but the gameplay is, is alright. There's no slowdown gameplay. So those are Killer Instinct. I just want to demo that. Uh, I did overclock it, and I'll put the overclock information at the bottom. And I'm also using a little bit better than the than the regular sand disc. Well, it's a, still a sand disc, but the speed is a little bit different. And I'll put that in the description as well. And thank you for watching. And I just went and moved the file over since I have you know plenty of space so and I went in uh, connected to the network and plug in my keyboard so got that working all right let's see oh let's go over some of this uh, some of the harder game like uh, uh, Dreamcast uh, I find out the Dreamcast game I have to uh, I have to use the keyboard to configure it because they were you can you could play it but you can't get out. So I went in uh, reconfigure the my joystick using the keyboard and uh, configure the the right hand size of the screen so that way when I don't want to play I could just press a button. Uh, and then I could get out. I think I set the L3. Yeah, L3. Either L3. Yeah, trigger, trigger, and the L3. So I think I I set it to L3 to exit out. Okay. So uh, right now I have one of the button, the main. Uh, I make this as uh, main main menu. So when you go to the main menu, uh, you could go to the input and press A button. Then you just pick the first joystick. And on this side is the one that I change. So let's move let's move down. Okay. So what I did is uh I have the I have to add a menu button which is the uh the my uh, insert coin and then exit out button. So I could go ahead and press a button to exit out. So I have to add those two, uh, otherwise uh, uh, everything else work except the main menu and exit out would not work. So just let you know. And so let's go back and play the game. Because uh, uh, we dream do not use uh, the select button just use a star button 
So I just use the start button instead. So press the start button and start the game. So A, B, C. Alright, let's get out the game. Uh, the, the way I get out of the game is I press my L R3. R3 is the one at the very bottom of my right there. I set that one to exit out the my uh, my my game. And so uh, let's try and find a more like a I guess Capcom first. We have Dead Alive 2. So that'll be fun to play. So those are the type of game that normally you cannot play on regular Raspberry Pi. Uh, this is Raspberry Pi uh, 4. Uh, eight gigabyte, eight gig, eight gigabyte. Uh, is a sixty-four bit. But the thing is that if you use an Android, you could overclock it to like a, uh, a little bit higher than uh, twenty-one four. So instead of just overclock it to, I think I clock it to twenty-one forty-two, I believe. And you could clock it. Up a little bit more higher with uh, with uh, Android than you could with uh, with the Linux for some reason. Uh, let's use the main character since I already configured two player. Oh, I keep on forget. I keep on pressing that. Pressing the stop, keep on pressing the select button. Alright, let's see if the second player will work. So, this is a two player, uh, final fight two player. Uh, the, arc, the system, I have to recreate the Pixie glass because the pixie glass on the deck was messed up. So I was I'm glad I was able to reproduce it and make it so now the for some reason is so too bright. So now the docking station now the docking station looks pretty nice. <laughs> 